Hello, welcome back, and welcome to 2015. Um, so we're back in the survival world, and uh, I got a lot to talk to. You. I got a lot to talk to you guys about today. Um, first off, I went strip mining, and we got some more gold. We got some more iron, which is actually good because I don't even think we have. Oh, we do have gold. Okay. Okay, so we got some more gold, and we got some more iron, which is great. Um, more importantly, we got more diamonds. We now are at four diamonds, and that's going to make us have a total of nine diamonds left, uh, which is amazing. I'm only going to take two of them here, so I'm going to put seven back into storage, which is good. We still have our diamond pick, and now I'm going to take these two, and you guessed it, guys. We are going to be enchanting. Um, I brought back some lava, because I, I was strip mining, so I brought back some lava. Um, <clears throat> we got a lot more cobblestone, again, because we were completely out, but I got a lot of cobblestone in that. I uh, got some more dirt, which I have a lot of now. Um, brought back some redstone. Uh, brought back an emerald, which was pretty good. We should probably get some more coal. Uh, but I brought back an emerald, which was great. And I think we got more... Oh! Oh, okay, that's why. I was gonna say, it scared me for a sec. Uh, we got more lapis lazuli, too, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, what I'm gonna be doing today is I'm gonna be making an enchantment table, and with that, we are going to actually go ahead and make an enchantment room. Now, we do have the sugar cane that's growing up there on the farm. I kind of extended it out a little bit uh, I did the best that I could so I don't know we'll see how that goes um, but we got two pieces of leather here which we are going to actually have to use to make books now that I think about it we need I believe it's one book and four things of obsidian I believe that's it four things of obsidian and one book to uh, oh that was a little lag spike here in order to make uh, an enchantment table so let's go outside and do that so first off um actually we can do that up here at our little courtyard thing because i have an uh endless pool or inf infinite watered well i don't know what you guys want to call it um okay so as far as that goes i've been working on it i still have to tweak it a little bit because i feel like oh this came in good um i feel like a lot of it's actually like there are mobs spawning inside it I really think there are because I kind of hear them, um, but the only problem is they're not, like, I'm not getting any drops, like, nothing is falling down, so, I don't know, we're gonna, I'm, I just have to go in there and I gotta see if I can fix it, probably just have to do a little bit of tweaking and stuff, but whatever, um, I'm only gonna make one book, you know, which I'm gonna use the craft it, obviously, uh, the other sugar cane I'm actually gonna go ahead and use to plant around here. So we can actually get this extended out a bit. Let's put these down and good. All right, so sugarcane farm's looking pretty good so far. Uh, we need to actually get some obsidian here. So let's go ahead. Um, okay, now I really don't want to mess this up here. I believe how you make obsidian is it's running water into lava. So let's see. Okay, perfect. Okay, so we got our four blocks here. Let's see if I remember how to do this. I think. It's this, and then... There we are. Wow, we got it, guys. Okay, so we're actually going to be enchanting, which is going to be... I feel like that's actually going to be really cool. We can we can make an enchantment room with just cobblestone. We can honestly just fit that around here somewhere. Um, but we're going to go ahead and actually go off to sleep real quick before we do that. So I'll get back to you guys in the morning. Okay, so I brought up some cobblestone, I got some glass, I got sandstone, I got torches. Um, we're going to go ahead and we're actually going to see what we can do with all this. I don't know. Maybe we can make a nice little building for our enchantments. Um, who knows? Let's see where we can go here. So, first off, um, I don't know why I'm lagging so much today. I don't know what's been going on, but uh, today I've just been experiencing a lot of lag. No clue why. Hopefully, it's going to fix itself. I don't know. Um, I guess I guess we'll just find out. But we're going to go ahead and, first of all, we're going to use that to light it up. So, we're going to make it just like this. We're just going to put a basic outline. There we go. Um, and the reason I'm doing that is because light actually goes through the enchantment table. It does work. And we're going to use this. There we go. Um... Now I'm kind of just putting out the basic outline first, just so we can get that out of the way. Uh, this is where the... And then we can kind of just build around this here. Okay, so that... So the cobblestone is where all the bookshelves are going. 
except for this block here in the middle which is actually where we're gonna put our door do I want to put it there let's see okay so gonna have to kinda mess around with this a little bit see what I want to do here I don't want to make anything too big that looks actually pretty perfect um, the reason I'm doing it so small is I really don't want to make anything too big because I just feel like that's unnecessary um, I just want a small little rebuilding thing that I can just go in there small little room enchant and then you know just leave do what I gotta do and that's it I don't want to make a whole big thing out of it for nothing um, okay so that looks pretty good let's see um, Okay, the way the door is, yeah, I don't, I don't necessarily like that. Okay, we're changing this. Hold on. Mm. Hmm. Okay. Um, so if we, yep, and then go back like this, let's fix this way. Okay, so the way I want to do this is, it's pretty much, it's already laid out, it's good to go. Um, again, a little much for just an enchantment room, but I mean, you know, whatever. Uh, I do want to make it look nice. So, now we're going to go ahead and we're going to make slabs, because I kind of want to use these for the roof. Okay, so the enchantment room is done. A little much for nothing. Uh, but I had a lot of cobblestone, and I figured, why not? I might as well make it interesting. Um, so the way it kind of works here is, uh, you know, I got a nice little roof, and, you know, that block's open and stuff like that. Uh, although I don't actually like that. Maybe we can... Yeah, let's do that, because I don't want anything jumping in here or whatnot, so let's just block it off that I like open the little crack on the it's on all of them which is pretty cool and it's got the torch so that light can also you know go through to the outside um, but yeah we have a torch under here which is gonna light it up because the light goes through that which is awesome um, we got this and then these spots are gonna be where I'm gonna put all the bookshelves when we eventually finished um, what is this <laughs> Oh my gosh, where have I been? I need to go into creative and I need to actually mess around with this a little bit because that is something I have never seen before. What is this? Two lapis lazuli, two enchantment levels, three lapis lazuli, three enchantment levels. Um, unbreaking one sharp. Okay. So it looks like they updated the whole okay first of all it's nighttime so um i need to go grab some stuff at home anyway so i guess uh, we'll get back to in this we'll get back to this in the morning okay so i'm back um i finished this little part of the sugarcane farm so there's only four more slots to go i can get working on that later um but more importantly uh so it looks like they've updated the whole enchanting system i did not know that and i guess Okay, so when you put something in, let's say, for example, this sword, uh, unbreaking sharpness, I guess that's all there is, and two lapis lazuli, so, um, okay, so, you put, okay, so that's how many enchantment levels, or it, it says three, but that takes five, okay, uh, <laughs> 
Okay, so I'm trying to understand this here. So I guess it takes Lapis Lazuli to enchant now for some reason. I don't know why Lapis Lazuli of all things, but I mean, like, I do have some. Um, that's weird. I don't know. Is it all dyes? I brought some more just to... Nope, it's just Lapis Lazuli. That's... Why? That's so weird. Okay, well, for some reason, Lapis Lazuli now has more of a use than just dye. Um... Oh. Okay, so now I don't understand this. It says there's only sharpness, sharpness, and unbreaking. So I'm guessing that when you add more bookshelves or whatever, I guess you can learn more. Like, let's say we take this pick. This is unbreaking, efficiency, efficiency. Okay, so I kind of want to put one, two, three. Um. Okay. So now I have unbreaking on here. I, I'm so confused. I don't, I'm not understanding this. So okay, so you can't put more than one thing. Obviously, protection, unbreaking. Okay, so if we put, what's the difference between these two? They're both protection one. So if I put that, I get protection one. Okay, and then if I get, or if I take this, and then what is this? Oh, well, what? <laughs> Can somebody help me out here, please? Like, some someone put something in the comments or whatever and just help me out because I'm not... On, well, what the... Okay, so we'll take projectile protection. And then... What's this? On breaking or protection. We're going to go with this. Protection. Okay. Oh, what just happened? It's not enchanted. Okay, I don't... Oh, it did not go through. Um, okay, so yeah, it does take my levels. I'm just trying to understand something, why this is, like, why is this so strange? Like, okay, let's say we take this sword. I can get smite or sharpness. I kind of want smite, so we're going to do this. Does it take two levels? Because it says two enchantment levels or five levels. It takes two. So I don't know why the, I don't even know what that number is on the side there. It takes two levels. Um, I got smite from that, which is very strange. I don't know. I have to, I got to do a little bit of research on the wiki and just kind of experiment myself a little bit because I'm not understanding exactly how the whole concept of that works. Obviously, when you put more bookshelves, then I'll take it that like, you know, you get more, more things open up. There's more things available. Uh, regardless, we do have enchanted stuff right now. Not worried that I kind of just wasted this using Unbreaking. Because when I get more bookshelves, I have enough diamonds, I can make another pick or two. And, you know, we can always enchant that. But I guess we have something for now. I'm happy I put Unbreaking on here at least. I don't know. That's very strange. I have to... I kind of got to look into that. I kind of like... I like how you can choose what you want on it. But at the same time, I don't like it because... You can, I guess you can only have one thing at a time. Maybe when there's more bookshelves, you can put more than one thing on. I don't know. Um, but also, that kind of sucks that you can't, unchan you can't enchant unless you have Lapis Lazuli. I think that's how it works. I mean, I would imagine just from the way it looks. So, um, Yeah, you can't enchant unless you have Lapis Lazuli, which I think is very strange that they did that. I'm not, I can't say that I'm entirely too happy with that. I don't know. Um, cause Lapis Lazuli isn't something that you, you know, you get that common. I mean, I do have, you know, 36, this is all I have of it. So, I don't know, it's not something that you get, you know, that ever so commonly that, you know, they can, I feel like it would make sense to do that, but, I don't know. Um, I guess I'll just do a little bit more research into it and we'll see. Anyway guys, I think I'm going to end it here. Uh, we got a little bit of work done with the sugarcane farm. We kind of extended it out. Uh, we got the enchantment table going, which is good, but I need to do some research to figure that out. Um, anyway, I think that's just about it, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Rate, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay tuned for more episodes coming up in the future. Questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to leave a comment below. Before I go, um, I would like to say that, again, with the server, guys, if the server's down, just give it a little bit. Give it, like, not even an hour, so just give it a little bit because uh, I'll go ahead and fix it if you guys really want it up you know quickly send me an email my email is in the description below or you guys can just comment on the video any video it doesn't matter um, and I'll get that back up also uh, I did get place I why did I just say that I did get Minecraft on the PlayStation 4 I got it 
and it looks pretty fun. I was playing it for a little bit, and it's kind of interesting. I don't know if I'm going to record. Maybe I will, and I'm kind of thinking I will, but uh, I'm not entirely sure, so I guess we'll see. I'll see about that. And also with the Far Cry 4 videos, I did get a lot of requests for that on Twitter, and um, I've been looking into it. I just need to find the time to do it, but I think I'm definitely going to be doing them. So anyway, guys, um, once again, hope you enjoy the video, and that's it. First video of 2015. Hope you guys enjoyed, and peace out.